Hey guys, I just wanted to uh, share a tip that really worked well for me. For those of you who are trying to make yourself uh, plexiglass windows, trying to replace your glass to uh, shave some weight. First of all, I recommend going with polycarbonate because you really don't have to worry about cracking it as much. But if you've scored some plexi and you want to try using that, I um, just wanted to show you the common problem with why it always cracks when you're drilling through. So usually it happens when you're drilling through a piece of plexiglass and you get to about this point, the tip of your drill is broken through. As soon as you lose some of that, that resistance from the entire cutting edge cutting at the same time, the rest of the cutting edge is just gonna break its way through and that's where you crack your plastic. So I found what works really well is to put a ridiculously steep point angle on and it makes your your drill break through very gradually so the the uh the opening in the material that it that it forms will gradually get bigger and the resistance to your pushing the drill through the material gets gradually less and less another thing is you can see this relief angle is not optimal at all. Roll it over here. Usually you don't want any of this touching, but with this one, you can see it's likely that just behind the cutting edge might be touching first. You still kind of want this to be touching first. I think I've gone a little too far on this one, but um, what you want is for it to be rubbing back here. That will also slow it down just so that it's actually a bit more of a controllable cutting action in plexiglass. This would absolutely uh, be a disaster cutting through a uh, harder metal, but with plexiglass, I'll demonstrate that it, it works pretty well to help you to not destroy the piece that you're going on. So I've got a piece clamped down here and I'm going to drill really close to the edge and I'm going to try to push it through pretty violently just to exaggerate the cutting actions of the two drills. So first I'll go with the traditional one and see if I can crack it up and then I'll go through just as harshly with the plexiglass one and hopefully it won't crack as much. So. Let's go. I'm just going to give her. You can see I just shattered that. Right? So, now with the plexi, drill, I'm going to go pretty close. I can't even push it through as fast. It just doesn't want to go. It was melting its way through there, but I was pushing just as fast. Or just as hard, I should say. And it just does not want to crack. It just... You can see that? That was right beside a cracked area there. But it just does not let itself pull through the material as fast. And you get this nice cutting action. So, um, definitely, if you've got access to a grinder and you're capable of sharpening your own drills, try messing with the angles like this, the way I showed you, and let me know how it works out.